Hi, I'm John Madrine. I'm here at Represent. We're going to talk to designers George and Mike Heaton about their latest collection for Autumn Winter 17. I want to welcome you to town. I've heard a lot about your brand, and this is really cool that you're, you're doing your show here, and you, you're being sponsored by Cadillac. What could be better than that? Yeah, it's great. I mean, we're very appreciative of CFPA for giving us this opportunity, and as a British brand, coming over to New York to do our show is such an amazing opportunity for us. So we'll do all we can to make it the best. The theme today, I understand, is New Breed, right? Yeah, the New Breed. It's a British invasion. Basically, we've, we're branding ourselves as like, coming over from Britain and creating something new that America's not seen. We're putting a lot of Victoria's British prints in. I mean, we're from the north of Britain, so for us, the collection's really inspired by our upbringings and the youthful cultures around the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Have you guys been wanting to show here in New York? Yeah, because like, our customer base is, is, is more powerful than America, so it makes sense to, to make a move. In the US, it's, it's more than everywhere else. Tell me about your aesthetic. So like our aesthetic is kind of like, we've, we've, we've broken down like the, uh, the subcultures of um, that time period that we've done this suggested before. And like, whatever we make, we always make sure that it's like wearable. And we always make sure that we would wear it because we're our, like, our target audience at the end of the yeah, day. We, so. We're just designing what we want to wear. And what are some of the details that are important to you? Yeah. We've got like our own like, fit of denim, haven't we, that we, yeah. that we keep like, every time. You know, we've got like the, the same aesthetics in the bombers and, and the jersey and having it oversized and all that kind of stuff. We're going to keep like the same uh, like style of denim throughout the seasons that we keep doing now. Like we've got a salvage collection and then we've got like a, a stretch as well with like a bit of elastane for people that like the, the more comfy they fit towards the more heavier denim. The hoodies for us is it's like the blazer for a suit. The key piece for every outfit. We wear it every day. We don't necessarily need to dress smart ever. So. To have the perfect fit and hoodie for us was massive. It's all some really great outerwear. It's like the parkers are inspired again by like the like the mod, the, yeah, the mod culture and like all that kind of like that little subcultures that was going on around that time period. Tell me about some of the shoes then. We did a, a boot called a dust boot and that was one of our first releases in the footwear game and it took 18 months to two years to develop and that was an absolutely major hit for us and we didn't we didn't have a clue like that we had that many customers. I mean at one point we put 300 pairs online and there was 13,000 people on the checkout page and it just shut our website down instantly. We've got a new boot coming out with Autumn Winter called Stomper which you'll see soon. You guys have a really cool website. You've obviously worked very hard and uh, make it available all across the world. The website for us was like the, the easiest thing to do. We don't have any like official stores yet so like that, that image you see on the website is like it needs to be good, do you know what I mean? We pride ourselves in like making it look as good as it can. Are you guys collaborating with any other brands for the shoes, for some of the accessories, or are the, are the accessories yours as well? Uh, the accessories are all ours. Yeah, we like to keep our things to ourselves. Everything from the footwear to the headwear is ours. At the end of the day, if you've got full control over it and you're not, you know what you're designing it for, then it's, it's easier to style. 